Damn, I'm chilling. Y'all know the vibes. Stick thighs, save lives. I'm at one of my favorite places, baby. Taco Bell. I'm in a parking lot. I've been sitting in the parking lot like 20 minutes. Because I don't know what time they stopped serving breakfast. And I don't know what time they started selling lunch. That's just my opening act to let you guys know. I like Taco Bell. And I don't know what time they stop or start selling breakfast. So, we fit to go see. What a close. <laughs> Welcome back to another mukbang, man. Y'all already know the vibes. Y'all already know the vibes. I'm at Taco Bell. I've been to the bank. Had to run some errands today. Because, baby... The bills are due. What else is new? I, I'm tired of them. I know you're tired of them too. The bills are due. I don't know what time Taco Bell starts selling breakfast. Stop selling breakfast or whatever. I'm just gonna roll this video all the way through. We're doing it. Let's do it. They don't have no Mexican pizza. That is sad. Hi, how are you today? Hi, how are you? Can I get your uh, double steak grilled cheese burrito? Okay. What are you today? Uh, Doritos Locos Taco Supreme. Supreme? Okay. And that'll be all, my love. Anything to drink with your water? Uh, give me a water, please. Water? Yeah. Any kind of sauce? Uh, mild. Mild sauce? Yes, ma'am. Okay, can you check the screen everything okay? Yes, ma'am, that's perfect. Okay, check it. Sorry, come to window. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. So nice this morning. Okay, clearly, it's 10 50. They start selling <laughs> real food at what time? I don't know. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm fine, you? I'm good, thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. She's so sweet. All right, girls, somebody get the food. Be right back. I'll tell you what, man. Um, I don't know if Chick-fil-A has gotten on to everybody in this vicinity about their customer service, but baby, it's working. Cause... <laughs> What it do? This is your favorite cousin, and I ain't put on no lotion, I'm, but I'm back with another banger. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that little bell notification so you can be notified when your favorite cousin posts another video. Baby, I'm at Taco Bell, and they got this new, they got this new burrito. But of course, I got my Doritos Loco Tacos. So they got this new burrito, double steak, grilled something burrito, grilled cheese burrito. Uh, y'all know review cuz Oh, it almost, it almost took a little tumble. Okay, let's get into this. Let's see. Let's see what we got, cuz. We about to see. We about to get into the goods right quick. See how they looking in the inside. I mean, on the outside looking in, this joint is, hold up, man. Oh, there we go. Found the mother load of, of cheese, ain't we? We found the mother load of cheese. It looks nice. <laughs> I mean, it looks, it looks Look at that, cuz. You see that? I mean, I'm gonna start turning that camera down a little bit. But it's kind of like a, a little baby. Look at that. I'm just I'm gonna hold it like a little baby. You see, I like it. Like, that's a thumbnail. Before we get to this good old bite, cuz, let's go ahead and get into the spread. Bite hit. I didn't mean to sound so rude, but you're gonna bow it. God, thank you so much once again for the food that you have prepared before my body. Thank you for your grace and your mercy, Lord God. Just thank you always, Lord God. No nerves, no anxiety. Whatever you see fit, let it be done, Lord God. You are always welcome in my heart. And anywhere that I am, I just want to say thank you in your name, my friend. Amen. Okay, cuz, let's get into this burrito. First of all, look at the cheese on the outside of that joint, cuz. Okay, I mean, look at all the damn cheese. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to break it in the middle. Oh, Damn, cuz look at this. Okay, okay, Taco Bell. Oh, it's got, what the hell? It's got rice in there, steak, buccal steak, rice, cheese. We're doing it. I'm just going in for the kill, cuz. Get into this bite. Oh, shoot. Hold on. What's that crunch in there? Honestly, it's got some. I didn't even know they had this. No, I didn't. Come on. Let me turn it down a little bit. So. I didn't know they had this. Look at that. I have no clue. That this is what we was coming here for. Not now. Look at it. See it? I had honestly no clue. 
You know, when I come to Taco Bell, I just get me a Doritos Loco Taco. That's it. And, and, and a little extra little something something. I don't know if me and food are becoming friends again or people just putting out some bomb food. Remember the video yesterday? What's on my face? With the seafood ramen. I didn't know that I was going to do that. I had no clue that I was going to do that. I had no clue that I was coming to Taco Bell and getting the best burrito of my life. I don't even like burritos. I know. Look at that. Man, I got some kind of paper stuff in there. What the hell? To try this like seriously this thing is loaded with meat rice To the last bite, cuz. Hear me out. I know it. Sometimes I just get a piece of food and I truly enjoy. This is nothing. This day two in a row. Day two in a row that I've gotten food that I actually love. Alright, cuz. Let's do it. The top of it is, the top of it is louder and cheese. That's like all cheese. So when they said grilled cheese, they meant grilled cheese. Baby, don't worry about that part. I'm always asking. They meant grilled cheese. So the outside is grilled with cheese. The inside has steak, rice, cheese. It's a pack. What the man, little Doritos in there? They look like little Doritos. But baby. Then you add a little sauce on that thing. Okay, Taco Bell. Taco Bell, you all right with me. No, I, I, had to come. I couldn't come here. I couldn't come here without getting my baby. No, I couldn't. That's my favorite taco from Taco Bell. I don't give a damn. Baby, you can count for Christmas. Don't make me choose. Don't make me choose. Don't make me choose between you. Show my food. Please don't make me ever choose between you and the Doritos, Loco, Saco, Smoko, Smoko, Taco. No. Just don't. Uh, it's not going to be a good look. It's never going to be you. It ain't. It ain't, baby. It ain't. You can count until Christmas. You got to lather that something going on. Taco Bell need to, Taco Bell need to put me on their payroll. Expeditiously. Hell yeah, they do, baby. Baby. I think this week has been my favorite week as a mukbanger. Favorite week ever. Now, 
We tried a couple of things this week. We tried a couple of challenges. We tried the Starbucks. We did the Ramens. We did the pink sauce. We did it. You name it, we did it. We didn't do it all. Let me know. What was your favorite video that I did this week? And I already know, YouTube don't even send notifications. By the time I see the Starbucks video, YouTube, it was like three hours, 800 views. YouTube just ain't gonna do it. It's all good. But let me know what was your favorite video you watched this week. I mean, mine was... I know. Mine was... Letting a person in front of me decide what I eat. I'm going to do that one again. But next time I do it, so next time I do it, I want to be surprised. I'm going to tell the, spit my bad. I'm going to tell the cashier, be like, hey, just give me whatever the hell they got. If it's a 100 piece nugget, baby, we're just going to sit here and eat a 100 piece nugget. I might come knock on your door and give you the rest, because we might. But. Personally, that was my favorite video. So drop in the comments what yours was because I already told you like I wanted to try like new stuff on the channel. I'm trying to like just kind of mix it up and still keep mukbangs and still inspiring and keeping my messages in the videos, but just kind of changing up the scene. Just kind of changing up the scene, cuz that's it, that's all. And y'all, could y'all do me a favor? Like the video. Maybe one day YouTube will put me back in the algorithm if you just like the video. Maybe. <laughs> Girl, I, I, I should be a damn shame myself. I'm not. I'm not. I really should be a shame. I'm not. I'm not. Uh uh. For what? Uh uh. Now, nah, hold on, I'm you what. Oh, hold on. Oh, no. Here's why I'm not ashamed. Baby, that was the last thing on my mind coming up that house this morning. You hit me? Baby. That was not one of my nose. Baby. Oh, I'm going to give you a review on that uh, burrito in a second. But, baby, I got something on my chest. Baby, lotion was the last thing that was on my mind this morning when I left that house. When I realized I had to pay them damn bills, baby, I wasn't worried about no lotion. Hell no, I wasn't. I wasn't worried about nothing. But the, but the payee, I said, damn, here they come again every month. It should be like a monthly fee for us to pay bills. It should just be like a month, like a set monthly fee. Excuse me. Just a set. Just a set monthly fee for us to pay bills. You feel me? I just don't think it's foul that every time you turn around, we got the empty and exhaust our bank accounts to go and pay Peter the Rob Paul. No, the Rob Peter the Rob Pay Paul. What? Is, I like, Rob Peter the Pay Paul? We had a Rob Peter the Pay Paul, ain't it? It's Rob Peter. The, <laughs> it's Rob Peter the Pay Paul. But yeah, y'all. So the. Um, so when I woke up, what's that? Cause you know I ain't gonna edit it out. Good stuff out in my teeth for here. Yeah, so I think we should be able to the prescription. Okay, the burrito for sure. I get out a solid eight out of ten for sure. Taco Bell just ain't really just putting out no quality stuff. Really, I mean we gotta call a spade a spade. But that right there was top tier quality. I mean this from the steak to the cheese to the cheese on the outside to the rice, it was action packed. Like it was packed. You know how they be stingy with their little sour cream and want you to pay 50 cents extra for it. Baby, they wasn't stingy on none of that. Now, the only thing I would have did different was add some sour cream because I love sour cream. If you're not a sour cream person, I really suggest you go and try this freaking burrito. The steak is good. I mean, like, you really can't complain about the concoction that they concocted because the steak, honestly, it, it looked like real steak. You know? It looked like real steak. And to be honest, it's it's tender. <laughs> it's tender. I couldn't believe it. Taco Bell. Everybody around here stepping that game up. 
Karina with her cooking to McDonald's this week with to, to Taco Bell putting out quality stuff. I mean, if the food service could just keep this going, even the customer service was good. We need to keep it up. We need to keep it up. We need to keep it up. <laughs> a proud moment. Okay, the Doritos Locos, not because tacos, tacos, brachos. That's a 10 for sure, always for the win. But I just came over here to say, hey, I love y'all so much. Don't forget to like the video, y'all, so YouTube can do whatever the hell they do. But we're still posting every every day. That's all good. But let me know which video you like the most this week so we can continue doing content like that. I'm going to still do full reviews, pop a muck long in there every now and then. I'm just kind of going through the process of seeing what works and what don't work. And what honestly, what I like to do because I like doing the... um. Let the person in front of me, of course, that was editing, which I don't mind editing. Y'all already know if you watch my vlog channel, which I ain't posted a vlog in a minute, but you know I me, mean, that's my favorite part of the vlog is, I mean, of the, <laughs> of the video is the editing, especially vlogs. So it's kind of like vlog style mukbangs. We're just doing it all good. So drop in the comments what you like and what you don't like. As always, I love you from the bottom of my heart. Keep inspiring. Just keep being who you are, cuz. And let me tell you something. If a person should be, listen. Be honest with people about who you are. Be honest with people about who you are. Be intentional with people about who you are. And give people an option on if they want to deal with you or not. It's not fair that we walk around lying to people and to ourselves about who we are. And then when we get somebody who deserves the person that we told them that they are, that you're not that person. Be honest with people. And be intentional with people. If they don't want to mess with you because that's who you are, then that's their loss. But... First of all, I know damn well. Baby. Oh, this way up. I know, but be be intentional with people. And, and give people an option, man. You know, if they don't want to message you based on who you are, then they don't have nothing to do with you. That's yo, that's their L. But don't walk around here, man, pretending to be somebody else. Cause just be yourself. It's only one of you. If a person doesn't accept that, you know, you who you are or what you have or what you bring to the table, then that's their L. There's plenty of people out here that will, but don't be selling false pe people, false figments of who you are, cuz. Don't do that. Don't do that. You know, I get on this damn camera every day. I am exactly who I say I am. I am ADHD as hell. I don't want no lotion. I'm not going to call you. I'm not going to call you back. Uh, don't call me. I'm not going to answer. Uh, <laughs> very standoffish, very antisocial, but I'm a great freaking person. That's me. That's who I am. Um, but I'm not going to sit over here and lie to anybody to make myself feel look or feel more appeasable to the eye so people can mess with me. Hell no. Well, I got a thousand in my bank account or 10,000 in my bank account. I'm going to tell you the truth and I'm going to give you an, you know, an idea on it, uh, the person that I am. And if you want to deal with me or not, thank you. If you don't, if you don't, that's your L. We be walking around here trying to impress people that ain't even worth impressing. They ain't even worth impressing. You ain't impressing people that got less than you, cuz. You probably don't know it because they, they, they once again, they lying to make it seem like they don't. But, any people on these social sites, cuz? Baby, I had read a post the other day. Well, I had shared a post the other day, and I think I saved it on my Instagram. But it said, social media got 22-year-olds wanting to off their sales because they don't make six figures and drive a seven series. Shit is terrible. Got, got women... First of all, whoever wrote this can't spell worth a damn. Got women thinking if you can't afford a Chanel bag, you're doing bad in life. And offer them nothing. What? I, first of all, is it them or me? Got women thinking if you can't afford a Chanel bag, you're doing bad in life. And offer them nothing. Got dudes thinking a good 9 to 5 is slavery. Nobody likes their body. Nobody likes their home. Just a mass group of people wanting what others have or pretend to have. Be yourself, cuz. Be yourself. That's it. Whatever you bring to the table... That's enough. It's more than enough for the right person. It's more than enough for the right person. But you got to be honest and walk in your truth and walk in who you are to yourself. Because that's what it is. That's what it ain't. I know me, like my self-reflection, I realized that I, I used to did not take accountability for any of my actions. Now that I do, I, I see the wrong in me a lot. I like it. I like it because it points out the areas that I can work better in. You know what I'm saying? Also, now I'm, I'm holding myself accountable for everything that I do. Uh, to myself, to others, uh, and I'm apologizing to people, and I'm holding myself accountable because I'm not always right. That's who I am. That's who I am. You feel me? But now I have to take that into consideration and be like, you know what? That's not who I want to be. So I, guess what I get? The option to change it. 
And those people who think they used to know me, guess what? They don't, cuz. Because every day you wake up, you got the, you got the option to change your mind on who you want to be. But as long as you're being real with yourself and real with people, cuz, just walk in your truth. That's just me, though. I'm fit to go. I love you. It's not on you. It's in you. What's in you that could never take life? Let's get it. This is your favorite cuzzle. Oh, hey, this is your favorite cuzzle. Y'all know what it is. You already know what to do, guys. Love and don't forget to drink with me. This is your favorite color. Get the team curtains. Welcome to shoot your ladies and gentlemen. You know why I like mug bongs like a lot? It's because they give me the freedom to express myself. They do. And so do you. Because I love you. I love you on a good day. I love you when we be beefing sometimes. I love you when I get on your nerves. I love you when you get on my nerves. You know, we can agree to disagree and still be family. A lot of people don't understand that. We could not. I had to have my health. I told you I A lot of people, you can agree to disagree and still be family. You know, I don't have to agree with you for us to be family. We don't have to have the same views. We don't have to have the same morals. We don't have to have the same opinion for us to be family. We don't. We don't. You know, I tell you this all the time. People still have started hating me for the same reason they started loving me. We can we can agree to disagree and still be family. It's all good. I love you, family. Let's get it. Cause.